Hello everyone, this is Cal with 2011 right now. I'm showing you a match where I just joined in. So this was me joining in, taking over a bot. Um, I recorded it after. <laughs> I noticed the powers it gave me were uh, rocks, or a uh, leap smash, rock throw, and charge. So there's no fire breath, and I've never ran a glass up without fire breath. But it's kind of weird. Down goes, who is that? Who is that? Who did I take out? That I don't even know. Wasn't medic. Oh my god, that rock throw. Right in the air. It might have been assault. I think I took out assault. Now I'm down here. I'm just trying to make sure they don't revive anyone. This was, the, I think, the second encounter because I joined and the bot was alone. It just evolved. And there goes assault. And when I walked like forward, I met these guys. <laughs> he was being chased and I didn't know it, so this was the encounter I got. Now I'm just trying to make sure everyone's dead. I could go after Trapper. Oh no, support. I'm going to go after support. He's going to go invisible. I see some jetpack, but a tree was in front of me. I can only guess he's that way. Now I've lost him, but if you look closely, there's footsteps appearing in that direction. So we're going to walk that direction and follow these footsteps that just magically go up here. Knowing his invisibility can't last forever, and there he is. So now I use charge against Brown. Smack him up a bit. Pounce, miss. Pounce, not that time. And uh, he's down. Now I'm going to go look around for the trapper. I haven't lost any health, which is kind of insane. But look around and... Uh, I don't see Trapper, I was thinking he'd ran this way. I thought it'd be near him. See, I thought he had dashed to the other side of the map, that's why I'm going all the way to the end. But I don't see any sign of him. Got 40 seconds, just looking around, I'm going to use the leap smash to get one more jump. And uh, I guess this is a good place to evolve. Just towards the back since I didn't meet him. I got uh, 30 seconds to get food before their dropship comes so they they can't follow me and engage. They're going to have to wait for me at the car plant. I just go all three in one. It's going to be more uh, strength. I got a lot of strikes on them. And uh, yeah, so see if I can't get some kill them fast. Do a rock throw. Beat smash straight up. And a charge that way. And he barely got into my health. Very, very minimal. Not gonna affect me at all. Shouldn't affect me at all. So now it's just getting more armor. A lot more armor. Just get armor. See this pest? Don't die. You're. I'm eating you to save this planet. Of course, these monsters actually need an origin story. Because God, it doesn't really make sense why. And right now would be a good time to use flame for that instead of throwing a rock at my food. You see the birds? Watch how the weird they move. They just, I don't know. They gotta do something about the birds. That's not really. I know they're supposed to fly, but whenever they flutter to one side and they're supposed to fly from this angle, yeah, this doesn't work out. I can get a two. And I get two pe- Oh no, I'm all armored up, so I don't even need to eat anymore. We're just going to go straight to the power relay. And, yeah. I can let them hear all the birds they want because they're not going to know where they know I'm coming. They can know I'm coming from this side. I choose this angle with Goliath because the cave entrance is right by the power relay. I'm not left out in the open getting unnecessary ar armor, uh chipped away. You can see this doom beetle. As soon as you're stage 3, every animal, except the tyrant, is scared of you. Maybe it, well, in a nomad, and now a reaver, I guess those are the only three. But everything else, mega mouse, scared. Doom beetle's scared. They talk all this trash to you about you going on their turf and eating their meals, but as soon as you get bigger, they turn into little They get a little mad. I'm trying to see where spot things out. I see some mines placed. And uh, here we go. 
They know I'm here. This is why I chose this angle. I'm gonna do a rock throw. Oh, an assault's almost dead. I gotta, I gotta get on that. He activates his personal shield. I just got Cabot on me. And that's gonna hit them both. There goes Cabot in the medic. Hit Cabot, nope, I did not hit Cabot. And Trapper's just staying up top, which he's... His stasis it does get annoying, but Assault's down. That's all from Assault. And Medic's down. Now, he's got the damage amp on me, but I'm just trying to make sure no one gets healed. I turn around and, yeah, Trapper does not want any of that. He knows. I'm just gonna wait for these two to die. They can only take, like, by themselves two bars of health, maybe. Maybe. All I need is the soft die. That's gonna hurt him. Dash away, and the salt's dead, and medic's dead. I throw it, and I'm not too sure if I hit him or not. But I'm looking for... Uh, I'm looking for him. He had one strike, and you can see the footprints going. Cabot just called for help. I'm gonna throw him at the edge of the footprints. Barbaric, so I'm pretty sure I got some people on that one. I'm looking around. And ooh, look at that. Support's injured. So I did hit him with that rock throw. I'm gonna smash him to the ground and well, all we have left is Trapper. I'm so sorry, Trapper. But I'm gonna have to finish you. I could have pounced on him, but with a minute left. Might as well just melee him. <laughs> I don't. Makes it a lot more funner. Leap smash one. Charge is gonna barely miss. Missed that. Oh, I guess uh, melee didn't miss. But I'm going to catch him. Be a smash way out there, and that's game, set, and match. This is Cowboy 2011. My PSN is Cowboy 11, and I'll see you guys all later.